Skinny jeans may be fashionable, but squatting in them for long periods of time may cause muscle and nerve damage. In a recent case study, a 35-year-old woman arrived at a hospital complaining of severe weakness in both of her ankles. Doctors say the day before, she had spent many hours squatting in tight jeans while emptying cupboards. Later that night, she developed numbness in her feet, tripped and fell, and laid there for several hours before she was found. By the time she got to the hospital, she had lost all feeling in her lower legs and feet. ER staff had to cut the jeans off her. It took four days of treatment before she was able to walk on her own again. A Seattle man is in trouble with the law over a sign. Daniel Gelke made a handmade sign to warn drivers of a speed trap. Five minutes later, a cop showed up and gave him a ticket for distracting drivers. He faces a $138 fine, but Gelke contends he did nothing wrong and plans to fight the violation. New technology from Samsung lets drivers see through trucks on the road. A camera on the front of the truck sends video to monitors on the back of the truck so cars can see a clear picture of real-time traffic. For now, the system is still in the early prototype stage. Fishermen in Australia caught a very rare basking shark off the south coast of Victoria. The last recorded capture of the species in this area was in the 1930s. The basking shark is the second biggest fish next to the whale shark. This one was more than 20 feet long. The creator of the pink plastic lawn flamingo has died. Donald Featherstone died Monday in Massachusetts after a long battle with dementia. He was a trained sculptor with a classical art background. Featherstone created the flamingo in 1957 for a plastics company, and since then, millions of birds have been sold. There you go, five things to know before you go to bed.